Hi guys, welcome back to another Itch.io free-to-play walkthrough. Today we have Slide. The game creators reached out to me to try out their game, so I actually missed their first message, but they did remind me, so I'm going to definitely check it out. Um, it's a racing game, and I haven't played uh, any racing games on the channel. I do like them, though, even though I haven't played one in forever. Like, I'm a big fan of, like, Snowboard Kids, Mario Kart, like, all the old ones. It's a little tar toy car racing game and Star Wars Pod Racer and all that. I like that you get choices for color. It doesn't seem like a lot of the stuff in the game's out yet, but this is just a demo. Ba ba ba. It'll be Leonardo, because he's the leader. And there only seems to be one track as of right now. Yeah, what I'm hoping is like, when the game actually comes out, there's like a system for just like, unlocking the, oh crap, how do I go? <laughs> I hope there's like a system for like actually Unlocking the stuff in the game like characters and like I hope there's like One thing that I feel like games don't have in them anymore is like unlocking things that have like different set I can jump dude. I didn't even know you could do that. Sick But like like in old racing games you used to be able to unlock faster cars or cars with like better handling and they like actually had different stats I think that would be really awesome if they did something like that. That's what I really miss instead of being like a DLC You actually have to like win races to unlock it Bro, I want to go fast, bro. They, these guys got like a, some kind of turbo butt boost. That uh, I want a turbo butt boost. Give me. Did he just jump that seaweed? Oh, oh. oh there's a boost. Oh, please. But yeah, hopefully it's something like that. Hopefully they have like either like, you know how you have cup, oh crap. Cup racing and like a Mario Kart. I keep dying, dude. Have mercy. <laughs> Please have mercy. But yeah, you have like cup racing and uh, Mario Kart 64 and... Oh, I made it! I'm a legend! Did you see that? Holy! I'm dead! Haha! <laughs> oh, they zap me. What the hell? Okay. But, uh... Yeah, I hope there's something like that. Like a tournament thing where you get like standings for doing so good in the races or something. You can unlock stuff. That's always nice. I suck, dude. I can't move. Didn't help. Alright, here comes the comeback. The fatty comeback. Y'all aren't ready for this. Turtle Man on the way. There seems like there needs to be more aggressive powers, though. It seems like it's lacking in the aggro powers. But this is just a demo. There seems to be like a ton of stuff they're going at. That gets me every time. I'm staying away from that power boost from now on. Every time, bro. Oh, it is not the key to victory right now. This is tragic. That seagull is so far ahead of everyone. Die, seagull, die. Hopefully that lightning bolt did something to him. I can't... Okay, we're gonna make this jump again. It's gonna be awesome. Watch this. Oh, that was amazing. I'm in second. Soon to be in first. Get out of my way, seagull. I <laughs> see you in hell. <laughs> <laughs> Raphael wins, boy! There's like all these death traps everywhere. Ooh, ooh, ooh! No, why would I do that to myself? Go! Please go! God dang. Please fall off the edge. Oh, we're so screwed. Somebody hit him with the lightning bolt. They did it! What a hero! Yes! Somebody wants me to win! Wow! <laughs> oh. That's freaking video recording advantage right there, boys. Oh, I actually made that without dying. Sick. And I got a shield. My destiny is to win. I'm a winner. I'm a winner. Shield. Ha ha ha. Ah, you thought so? I didn't even tried to lightning bolt me at the end. That was amazing. Now, that was a short video, though. Well, I guess I could play another game as well, but yeah. I hope that the creators do something like I was saying with like a tournament or something where you unlock things. That'd be so sick. Instead of just like either automatically getting them and not having to earn them or like um, having to buy DLC. I really hate the DLC system. I think it's kind of cool if you add something that's like completely different, but if it's something that should already be part of the game. But this is uh, the credits as always. I would like to show off the creators and it's, they put in probably a ton of work to the game. Um, but yeah, the music's really nice. The graphics are good. It feels like a Mario Kart game. I wish there was more like aggro weapons to screw people up with. And I'm sure this would be a ton more fun with friends. 
Uh, when it comes out on Steam, I'll probably play this with uh, Andrew and uh, Riley, the dudes I did a crappie boy with. Yeah, I think that'll be a ton of fun. But thanks for watching as always, guys. I'm going to try to find another game because this was a pretty short video. I didn't expect to win on the first time. But as you know, Raphael is the leader in the Ninja Turtles. I would have been Mikey if Mikey was there. Is there a Mikey caller for our turtle? See, Mikey's not unlocked yet. I would actually be the Panda Turtle if I could. But that's not an option either. Hi, right, guys. See you in the next part. Ah, kind of. Alright guys, welcome back to another Itch.io free-to-play walkthrough. Today we have The Coco Night, which will be our second game for the day. The Coco Night was produced as a partnership between the Make-A-Wish Foundation of Vermont and Red, Mag Red Magpie, a non-profit game development studio based in Vermont. It was Mika's dream to make a video game, and here it is. The Coco Night is an isometric RPG wherein the player explores a magical island to find and rescue captured coconut friends and return them to their homeland. Along the way, they must complete simple location-based challenges and fight different types of enemies. I'm all about that. Alright, let's give this game a try. That's pretty awesome though that they did- Oh, and it's got a co-op. But I'm just one person. Coconut Island. Uh oh. A beautiful place named for the curious creatures that inhabit the land. Friendly by nature, the coconuts prospered in a peaceful kingdom that cared for all who touched its sand. However, a gentle heart is easily seized, and the less kind island dwellers eventually grew less than pleased. Why should the island belong to those weaklings? <laughs> they roared, conspiring in the dead of night. Oh, we God. are bigger and stronger than they. They would hardly put up a fight. Don't and so, acting. Their wicked plan was hatched. They invaded the kingdom. They swiped. They snatched. The island fell dark, overcome with hate. But a new hero arrives to bring a new fate. So heed these words, and please make haste, lest this island paradise fall further to waste. Wait no longer, no ifs, ands, or buts. Venture forth and rescue these poor coconuts. <laughs> it arrived. <laughs> That's pretty good. I dig that. That's a good start. Alright, how do I play? Uh, Wasted. Oh, Lord, it went too fast. Okay, I got you. We got a stick. We got. Oh, we're gonna set a fire here. This is what we do. I don't know how to use the items I have, though. The okay. flames lick close, kind and warm. Across the coals glows a ghostly form. Hopefully, it's loud enough for you guys. He's kind of quiet. Tired lines sharpen in the flickering light. The weathered face of the last Coco Knight. I'm the Coco Knight. Be not afraid. I so quiet. No friend. Lest you fight, this island shall be its end. Sorry if it gets super loud. I just gotta turn it up because these guys are whispering at us. I was once the kingdom's last fire. But since my death, their safety did decline. <laughs> I like Rodney. That's You'll nice. Find my friends where the land meets the sea. You'll find them hidden in the shade of a tree. And if you wish to save them all, climb the mountain and do not fall. Too easy. I give you my treasures, my spear, my shield. When faced with monsters, pity do not yield. Go forth, protect, do what's right. Within you lay the spirit of a true Coco. I am the true coconut. The specter fades, and your heart feels renewed. To succeed, you'll need to be brave, fast, and shrewd. With warm sand beneath you and the breeze to your back, you've got some coconuts and monsters to track. Oh, sick. Hi. Right. How do I use this, though, to actually fight? X key. Okay. Yeah, this is pretty, pretty amazing so far. X to attack. A. B to shield. Oh, wow, I got the sun as a shield, son. Do not mess with, with me, boy. Oh. Hi! Ha ha! Did I get him? Yeah. Easy. Free him. Free the coconut. Oh, he's so cute. Look at him. Aw. Look at the little fella. What's the slingshot? A to dash. Oh, right trigger. Slingshot. Boom. Too easy. Where am I slingshot now? Is the coconut man following me? Aw. I have a coconut baby. We'll call him Frank. Get him, Frank! Please! These things, okay. 
Ha! Ha! <laughs> Alright. Good job, Frank. I don't know what you did there, but way to be part of the team. Squad. There's another one! My baby collection will grow. What is that thing? If you hit me- Ooh, it's- Oh, it's winning this! This is hard to aim. I'm on my last thing shot bullet. And it doesn't even- I just murdered that bird in cloak blood. Alright, you're George. We got Frank and George. <laughs> oh. Why does Frank look like a volleyball, though? George looks like an actual coconut. What is my goal here, actually? What is my Oh, to climb the hill. Climb the hill. Do not feel something, something. I'm gonna run. Oh, I'm so confused where I'm going. It's all good. Oh, wait. Get him! Frank and George! Unlimited power! Oh, cash? Oh, let's show. Let's see what happens. Hit me. Oh, he's scared of my shield. <laughs> well, there's not much difficulty in the game, but I like the story. I like our coconut friends. Um, and the music's nice and relaxing. I wish everything was a bit louder, though. I don't know if there's like a sound setting. Oh, pause. Oh, there is no pause. Oh, I don't, I'm not pausing. I don't like these birds, though, because they have better aim than I do, which is not cool. And you will be Linda. Linda, come on! What are you doing, Linda? Linda's just sitting there. Oh, I just got hit! You actually hit me? Come on, Linda. Yeah, that's definitely Linda. Frank, George, and Linda. Let's go, guys. Dun -dun -dun -dun. If you counter-strike me, ESP, because you're a fantasy app boy, I will... <laughs> oh, I'll be livid. I will be actually livid. Don't even think about it, ESPN. Don't go there. <laughs> I didn't ask your fantasy app to go off. <laughs> oh. And you will be Nathan. Frank, George, Nathan, and Linda, let's continue our quest. I have taken two hits. One of them is because of ESPN. How do I use the key on this? I have a key. Maybe I'm missing a coconut or something, that's why I can't... Let's keep looking. I think I'm missing something. That's probably why it's not letting me open it yet. Oh, yeah. That's Larry. Frank, George, Nathan, Linda, and Larry. The squad. Okay, now it should open, right? No? Ah, dang it. Okay, what else can we do? These birds! Yeah. Take that, bird. Okay, this is where I went up hill earlier, I believe. Go this way. I'm lost! <laughs> I'm so lost. And this will be Johannesburg. Welcome to the squad, Johannesburg. And you will be Yolanda. Oh, there's nobody in there. Oh, yeah, they are. Yolanda! Greg, George, Linda, Larry, Nathan, Yola Johannesburg, and Yolanda. The squad. I'm... My key's not working on any of these doors, though. I don't know, bro. I'm so lost. I am so lost. Send help, coconuts. Okay. Oh, maybe this is a door. Oh, sick! We did it! Progress! And then we found another key. Wow. Wow. <laughs> okay. That's questionable level design. <laughs> you put a key so I could get to another key. That's that's something. <laughs> I don't agree with your methods on that one. Still digging the game though, but I because I was so concerned because I didn't have a key to open these doors. Oh, this still isn't the key for that though. It must be for the one that's up north. It's another key to get to a key. Only a key, and there's no coconut behind it. I'm gonna be. <laughs> well, at least at that point, they'll be consistent. Still won't agree with it, but at least it's consistent. That's awesome, though, that they did this as like a make a wish like uh, thing. That's sick. Oh, God! That dude just boulder chucked at me. Alright, dude. He's hurting me. Okay. Okay. Oh, my the God. The beach is safe. 
you've done all you could. Now, head north into the wood. We're not naming those. <laughs> we just had four babies at the same time. <laughs> you don't get names. <laughs> Bilbo, Bob, Dave, and Sarah. Let's see if I can remember all the names at the end of the game. I doubt it. Bilbo, Bob, Dale, and Sarah. Next level. Did I miss any coconuts? Is those empty wraps the coconuts I missed or something? How do I go to the next level? Send help. Okay, I gotta click on my mouse. The trees loom tall, the canopy thick. Did someone just cry, or was it a trick? Take oh. care where you tread, and keep your eyes peeled. Steady your spear, and ready your shield. The creatures grow cruel in the forest's dark core, the further in you venture from the sandy shore. But have heart as you wander, and always be brave, for there are more coconuts here to save. What happened to my last coconut babies, bro? Are they gone? That's tragic, dude. We bonded. <laughs> oh, Bill, Bo, Frank, Dave, Sarah, Linda, Larry, uh... Johannesburg, Yolanda. We had other ones. Gosh dang it. Uh, Larry. Oh my god, I can't remember the rest of my coconut tribe. Uh, who's the. F oh wow, I can't remember the first ones anymore. It's tragic. George. I think George is one. Uh, those rock people, man, are vicious, like for real. It's hard to avoid damage with them. I'll try to remember their names before the end of this level. Y'all aren't getting names anymore, though. There's too many of y'all, and you get replaced at the end of the level anyways, which is tragic. I'll miss my last coconut tribe. Uh, Linda, Larry, Gorge. Oh, no. Oh, no. Tragic. I was gonna say I, was, I would never forget you guys, but I already did, so that just... <laughs> I'm a liar. Yeah, I'm gonna use a slingshot on the rock people, I think, from now on. Because I have not been able to avoid damage against them, like, yet. But I think the slingshot's actually the play. Did I just go in a big circle? Yes, I did. Wow, good job, me. Way to do the thing. But yeah, this game's actually pretty amazing. Like I said, it's not something that's going to difficulty league challenge you, but the story's kind of cute, and the graphics are pretty nice, and the music's calming. I think they're playing on the ukulele, or the ukulele. Oh god, birds! Birds! Kill it! Oh, it's looking at me! Oh, they're easy to hit. Never mind, I thought I was going to have to do something crazy to hit them. Y'all are weak! <laughs> okay. Flying enemies usually put me on guard, but these guys ain't too bad. What's this? What did I just pick up? Let me grab this, whatever this is. Ammo? Yeah, it's ammo. Do 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 do. That's a deer! Whoa! Whoa! Yeah, take that. <laughs> what kind of noise is it making when I'm hitting it? It's like, uh huh, uh huh. I feel like a bully now. <laughs> God. <laughs> That's alright. I just killed Bambi for no reason. Was there a reason for me to be up there? There's a lot of traveling in this game that confuses me. Uh oh. The shadows loom. You hear an eerie hey, drip. save everyone. A strange, distant noise makes your stomach flip. Tread with quiet steps, but stay sure. Be brave. Final boss. There are evils lurking in this old cave. Oh, my squad. Where'd you guys come from? One of them is a pineapple. He is not a coconut. That was absolutely not a coconut. All right. <laughs> Oh boy, I'm gonna test my strategy against you now. And then the bird hits me because I suck, actually. This isn't working. Rockman is too strong. My dash key's not working. There we go. Where am I supposed to be going here? Oh, we're outside the cave. Well, that was easy. What dangers? I wonder if there's like a benefit for finding all the coconuts, or if you have to find the coconuts, or if you can beat the game without finding any of the coconuts. Curious. Where am I? 
Who am I? I should go back into the cave, I believe. I feel like I'm missing something important. What's over here? This is where the deer was, right? Yeah, that's where I killed the deer. My bad. Okay, let's go deeper into the cave. I feel like I was making a tragic mistake by going that way. Tragic. Where's the final boss at? Come get these hands. I like that one's hat. Can I put fire on my spear? That'd be kind of sick, right? Where are we? I don't think there was really that much evil stuff in the cave, surprisingly, unless we haven't completed the cave. Okay, maybe there's more cave stuff. I don't know, man. This cave's not looking as treacherous as the narrator alluded to. I think that was like, wow, biggest hype job of 2020. <laughs> narrator, man, why are you trying to get us like all riled up about... There's not even a boss in here, dog. There was not even a boss in that cave. Narrator, man. Misleading people. I need to go on that beach up north, actually. After I get done killing these guys, I guess. This is back into the cave. I guess. I don't know. I'm lost. Send help. Okay, maybe we're not done with the cave yet. We're at the second level of the cave now. This is where the true final boss is. Nope, we're not going down there yet, because I've already been down there, I believe. Now, now, brown cow. Nope, there's no true boss up here either. Huh. Yeah, the cave was a, uh, just a hype job. <laughs> not as scary as narrator thought. Oh, I guess you probably do have to get all the coconuts, because it uh, told me when it goes back to the boat, it wasn't just like... Oh, you can go to the boat whenever you want. It's like, now you can go to the boat. I gotta figure out how to get to the left side over there. Thought I could get up there from that part of the cave, but... Oh, here we go. Yeah! Slingshot's really hard to hit. I don't think you can hit flying things with the slingshot. Confirmed. Slingshot kind of hard, bro. Unless it's like the rock dude or the deer. Huh. What do I need that key for? I haven't met many locked doors or anything while I've been playing this. Oh gosh. The search can begins. Maybe I can go this way. Is water gonna kill me? No. But I can't go that way either. Holy Come with me, coconut family. We gotta find our way, I guess. You know the way. Coconuts. Coconut. You know the way. <laughs> Cause I don't. I really don't. Banana. This is the way I've been to already. What is this key for? Well, at least what, Lily found us. Her name's Lily. The rest of you don't get names. Oh, pineapple boy can be definitely not a coconut. Oh, there we go. Don't look at me, dear. Kill Bambi. Come here, Bambi. You don't want these problems. Makes like a really cute noise while it's getting hit, though. I don't know why that's like that. Pressing. Not as evil as we thought it was. There's gotta be a key place up here somewhere, probably. Right? Gosh. Darn. This is the cave of nothing important, right? This is the cave of nothing important? Looking like it. Wow! Guess what, guys? <laughs> There's nothing important in this cave. Wow. <laughs> okay. Alright, squad. Um... I hate to break this news to you, coconuts. Well, we're lost. I am not the coconut knight with GPS. Unfortunately. Another cave. No, that's, I've been here too, bro. I really do not know where to go. Oh, he hates it. Oh, gosh. Darn, dude. This is so unfortunate, actually. I have a key. Where does the key go to? Sorry, <sighs> minds want to know. Hmm. Like, a, is there a map? Can I access a map somehow, dude? That'd be so sick, actually. Okay, we gotta get over there somehow. We found our way. 
Thank goodness. How do I get in there? Show me the entrance. Okay, I'm stuck. Okay. Alright, can I not go this way? Mm -hmm. Can't go that way. Weird. Why? I will go all the way around. Follow me, coconut family. Goodness gracious. Just want to live my coconut dream. A coconut night. It's not all it's cracked up to be without a proper GPS system. But yeah, that's about the only complaint I could even think about with this game. A map would be super nice, <laughs> to be honest. Uh, but it's not. I mean, it's not too difficult. You're not going to figure it out if you don't wander around like a ding dong for like a while. What is this thing? Clock. These birds, I don't even know if these things fight, to be honest. Like, they just sit there and look at me fiercely. Oh, that was the thing I put the key you in. It wasn't a your clock. friends from each woodland beast. Now look to the mountain. Jaw set, brow creased. Nice. Return to the boat. Shortcut. Yes, we made it. Can you believe it? The air starts to thin, and your breath catches in your chest. Your journey's end approaches, yet there's no time to rest. Thanks, Dr. Seuss. You turn back to the forest, <laughs> but your mind is on the peak. Your next destination after you find here all you seek. We're finally going to the mountain, huh? Oh man, I have some skeleton coconuts, that's crazy. They're like stacking on their heads, that's cool, I dig it. The path is rough, have no doubt, and the trail is fraught with woe. But to save the kingdom and end your quest, to the peak you must go. The night is long, but the end is close, and soon the dawn will rise. The sun's rays streak and shoo the stars, and clear the darkened skies. Though distant and frail the thought might seem, have faith in your own skill. For your face alone makes monsters scream, and your prowess scares them still. My face makes them scream? Fight damn, well, am I that ugly? And tarry oh, not shit. on the mountain's dreadful I mean, slope. Well, dang. Be swift and sure, for to this land you are a beacon of hope. Yay. We're doing it. The final quest. What's up, guys? <laughs> Yeah, be scared of my face. Yay. We did it. Got the key. What's this? Oh, Bambi. Oh, he got me. Well, you got me, Bambi. Good job. What's blinking over here? Coconut Familia, we must make it to the top of the mountain. We will take no prisoners. No prisoners. Maybe this will be a straightaway and I won't have to get lost like I did last map. That'd be cool. <laughs> Who are you people? Why are you harassing the coconuts? Oh, you're some. Oh. Fade away. Fade away. Kobe. <laughs> you too. Oh, whoa. Who's this? A foolish hero on my peak. You are but a child, a worm, a pipsqueak. I have stayed in the shadows my whole miserable life. Wouldn't you agree? I've earned the right to spread strife. So take up arms and say your last prayer. You'll regret stepping foot in the Coco Napper's lair. The Coco Napper. <laughs> Alright, dude. You gotta think of a better name than that. You're gonna be all fierce and stuff. Oh, you're, you don't even stand a chance. You're so big, bro. Oh, and he hit me. Okay, okay. Alright. I see you. I see you, big swole. Coco Napper. I got you. I see no. it. That was kind of tragic, bro. He even said no. I feel that's actually feel bad. Well, he did kidnap my coconut children, so I guess he deserved it. 
Sorry, coconut hopper. We got a little more skull coconuts. We win! We the best! How do I get down? Like this! Yeah, again, this was an awesome game, and I think it was awesome that they did like a Make-A-Wish thing with, uh... I believe the name was Mika... Yeah, I think it's pronounced Mika. But yeah, amazing game. Good job. I like that this stage was like a straightaway, to be honest. And I like that there was a final boss fight, so it kind of felt like there was a payoff to getting to the end and everything. Nice. And we rescued all the coconut family. Coconut is family. Look. Great. The creature falls, slain, a pitiful dead lump. You stand above victorious, spear raised in triumph. I like the rhymes too. That's sick. You descend the treacherous mountain coconuts in tow, heading towards a secret hidden just below. The Coconut Kingdom's entrance is guarded by a great golden gate. They stand tall, locked up tight, till a hero cleanses the island of hate. The gates swing open and your friends rejoice. The old coconut had made the right choice. The kingdom is saved and they usher you through, offer you shells, gems, fish, and even fruit too. You are hailed as a hero, a savior, a knight. <laughs> He's got a the ukulele. coconuts marvel at your resolve and might. With no hesitation, they welcome you to their home. The kind people of the kingdom have named you one of their own. And so, our tale ends with a marvelous feast, in honor of the hero who slayed the scheming beast. We praise you, young hero, for not giving up the fight. We praise you, dear child, the new Coco Knight. <laughs> All right, yeah, that was amazing. That was cool. Thanks for watching, as always, guys. Appreciate uh, everyone that worked on both of these games. They were a ton of fun. All right, guys. Oh well, credits. I the, oh, I try to make a point if I to never skip the credits if they actually if the game's beatable, anyways. They did an amazing job, and they're doing the Lord's work. That was awesome. Oh gosh, my back. I got I cut out the parts where I died or got stuck. I didn't die. Mika Millard. Nice. Rad Magpie Studio. That's a pretty good name for a studio. Thanks for making the game. Hi, guys.